right, so LeBron James opted out. We expected that. That's not surprising. Cleveland, you still have a chance to retain the services. But, but if LeBron can't get nobody to play with him in Cleveland, then he's going to take his services somewhere else. LeBron is trying to win championships. Hey, I can't blame him. And Cleveland fans, you can't knock him. He got you a title. But he don't have the pieces to win in Cleveland right now. So he's going to explore his options, see what's out there. Maybe in L.A. or Houston. And he's going to make a decision. Only way you lose LeBron James is if he can't link up with enough guys to challenge for a championship in, 20, in 2019. Hey, he's trying to catch Jordan to win six titles. I mean, that's, the, uh, that's, that's, his, that's what he's trying to do. But Cleveland, you're still in it. If the Lakers don't end up getting Kawhi or Paul George, LeBron won't even go to L.A. by himself. That's why he's been calling guys all week. He's trying to play with guys that can help him win, win a championship. That's it. If Kawhi doesn't go to L.A. in a trade, if Paul George signs with OKC, then LeBron will be right back in Cleveland for another year. That's how it's going to play out. He won't sign with nobody right away because the dude is on vacation. He's on the phone calling guys. LeBron's main objective is to win championships. That's it. So he's going to take his, take his time with the decision, see who he can play with, to give him that best chance of beating Golden State. They're the, they're the biggest dog out there. So he's trying, to knock, he's trying to knock them off their perch. This is Corner Sports Net.